2025 is shaping up to be an absolutely epic year for stargazers, astronomy enthusiasts, and anyone who loves looking up at the night sky. From dazzling meteor showers to rare celestial events, this is a year you don't want to miss. Get ready to mark your calendars, because here's your ultimate guide to the astronomy calendar 2025. Let's kick things off with the quadranted meteor shower on January 3rd. Known for its bright fireballs, this shower promises up to 120 meteors per hour under dark skies. Talk about starting the year with a bang. Just a day later, on January 4th, Earth will reach perihelion, its closest point to the Sun. That's about 3 million kilometers closer than average. While we won't feel the difference, it's still a cool reminder of our cosmic journey. January gets even better with a planet parade. On the 8th, the Moon will join Venus, Mars, Jupiter, and Saturn in a stunning alignment. Four of these planets will be visible to the naked eye, so be sure to look up. On January 12th, Mars will be at perigee, its closest approach to Earth in over two years. It'll shine brightly, and you won't need a telescope to appreciate its fiery glow. Then, on January 13th, we'll witness the Wolf Moon, the first full moon of the year. And the very next day, the moon will temporarily hide Mars in a rare lunar occultation. Don't miss Saturn and Venus on January 18th, appearing so close they'll look like celestial dance partners. And if you're not free that evening, don't worry. They'll perform an encore a couple of days later. February brings even more excitement. On the 1st, we have a triple conjunction, where the crescent moon will sit between Venus and Saturn in the evening sky. This beautiful celestial alignment will be a sight to behold. On February 2nd, the moon will rejoin the ongoing planet parade, providing another chance to see all the planets in alignment. And on February 4th, Jupiter ends its retrograde motion, returning to its usual eastward movement through the constellations. On February 16th, Venus will reach its peak brightness, blazing at a magnitude of negative 4.6. It will be the brightest speck of light after sunset in the western dusk sky. Known as the Evening Star, Venus will be impossible to miss. On February 23rd, Mars will end its retrograde motion. After weeks of moving westward through the constellations, it will reverse direction and resume its usual eastward movement across the night sky. On March 12th, Saturn will reach its solar conjunction. This means the ringed planet will pass directly behind the Sun as viewed from Earth, making it invisible in the night sky. On March 14th, we have the stunning Blood Moon Eclipse. Visible from parts of the Americas, Antarctica, Alaska, Northeastern Russia, and Africa, this total lunar eclipse will provide a captivating red glow in the night sky. On March 14th, sky watchers will get a chance to witness the Gamma Normid Meteor Shower, the only meteor shower of March. March 20th marks the spring equinox, where day and night are equal. It's the official start of spring in the northern hemisphere and fall in the south. The perfect moment for sky watching. On March 23rd, Saturn's iconic rings will appear to vanish from view as they turn edge on to Earth. This rare phenomenon happens because the thin rings will align perfectly with our line of sight, making them incredibly difficult to see. March 29th brings a partial solar eclipse. This event will be visible from parts of the Americas, Western Russia, Europe, and Africa. April will be a month of meteors and planetary events. On April 22nd, the Lyrid meteor shower peaks, delivering up to 18 meteors per hour, the best meteor display of the month. On April 24th, Venus will reach its brightest point in the sky, dazzling at a magnitude of negative 4.5. In the early hours of April 25th, 
the sky will host a stunning triple conjunction. A waning crescent moon will pass close to the dazzling Venus and the majestic Saturn, creating a picturesque alignment in the pre-dawn sky. Mark your calendars for May 5th as Mars teams up with the Beehive Cluster M44 in the constellation Cancer for a breathtaking conjunction. The planet will pass within just half a degree of this dazzling star cluster, offering a spectacular sight through binoculars or a small telescope. This is a celestial treat you won't want to miss. On the morning of May 6th, prepare for a dazzling meteor display. The eye Aquarian meteor shower, originating from the debris of Halley's Comet, will light up the sky with up to 40 meteors per hour at its peak. The best time to view these fiery streaks is in the pre-dawn hours from a dark, clear location. On the same day, Saturn will experience its own version of an equinox. The Sun will cross over the planet's equator, marking the change of seasons on Saturn. During this celestial event, the planet's famous rings will appear edge-on to the Sun, casting minimal shadows. While this is not visible from Earth, it's a fascinating reminder of the dynamic nature of our solar system. On June 21st, the summer solstice marks the first day of summer in the northern hemisphere and winter in the south. The sun will shine directly over the Tropic of Cancer, giving us the longest day of the year. On June 24th, Jupiter will reach solar conjunction, passing behind the sun as seen from Earth. During this time, the planet will be completely hidden in the sun's glare and unobservable for a few weeks. On July the 6th, Earth will reach aphelion, its farthest point from the sun in its orbit. At this point, Earth will be approximately 3 million kilometers farther from the sun than its average distance. Interestingly, this celestial milestone occurs during summer in the Northern Hemisphere, reminding us that seasons are influenced more by Earth's tilt than its distance from the Sun. On July 13th, Saturn will begin its retrograde motion, appearing to reverse its usual eastward path through the stars. The Delta Aquarid meteor shower will peak on July 29th, treating observers to up to 25 meteors per hour. For the best experience, Find a dark location away from city lights and look to the skies after midnight. August is going to be incredible. On August 12th, the Jupiter-Venus conjunction will take place, making these two bright planets appear almost touching in the pre-dawn sky. Also, on August 12th, the Perseid meteor shower will reach its peak, producing up to 150 meteors per hour, the perfect chance for sky watchers to catch a shooting star. On August 31st, Venus will have a stunning encounter with the Beehive Cluster M44 in the pre-dawn sky. The two celestial bodies will pass within one degree of each other, creating a beautiful alignment. On September 1st, catch a glimpse of the Origid Meteor Shower, which is known for its fireballs originating from Comet Keys. You can expect up to six meteors per hour, best viewed under clear skies after midnight. On September 7th, a total lunar eclipse will be visible from parts of Antarctica, Asia, Russia, Africa, Oceania, and Europe. During this event, the Earth's shadow will completely cover the moon, turning it a reddish hue, creating a spectacular celestial sight. On September 19th, the Moon will temporarily hide Venus in what's known as a lunar occultation. This rare event will be visible from certain parts of the world as the Moon passes in front of Venus, obscuring it for a brief period. September 20. Venus will pass extremely close to Regulus, the brightest star in the Leo constellation. This will be an amazing sight in the eastern pre-dawn sky with Venus and Regulus appearing very close to each other. On September 21st, Saturn will reach opposition, making its closest approach to Earth. 
The planet will rise in the east around sunset, reach its highest point in the sky around midnight, and set in the west at dawn. This alignment offers the best opportunity to see and photograph Saturn and its spectacular rings. On September 21st, the year's final partial solar eclipse will occur. It will be visible from parts of Antarctica and Oceania. During the eclipse, the Moon will cover part of the Sun, creating an impressive, though partial, celestial event. On September 22, the autumn equinox marks the time when day and night are nearly equal in duration across the Earth. During this event, the Sun will shine directly over the equator, signaling the first day of fall in the Northern Hemisphere and the start of spring in the Southern Hemisphere. On September 23rd, Neptune will reach opposition, making its closest approach to Earth. The blue planet will rise in the east around sunset and stay visible all night. Although it won't be visible to the naked eye, a telescope will reveal Neptune as a small, bluish disk, perfect for astronomy enthusiasts. On October 2nd, the Andromeda Galaxy will be at its highest point in the sky, making it the best time to observe our galactic neighbor. Mark your calendar for October 6th, when the hunter's moon will rise as the first supermoon of the year. This full moon will appear bigger and brighter in the night sky, a treat for both stargazers and photographers. The Draconid meteor shower will peak on October 9th, offering up to 10 meteors per hour in the early evening sky. Though a minor shower, it's unique for its best viewing being just after sunset, rather than in the pre-dawn hours. On October 21, don't miss the Orionid meteor shower, one of the best celestial displays of October. On November 5, witness the biggest and brightest full moon of the year. Known as the Beaver Moon, this supermoon will dominate the night sky with its luminous glow, an unmissable treat for all sky watchers. On November 11, Jupiter will halt its usual eastward path through the constellations and begin its retrograde motion, appearing to move westward in the sky. The Taurid meteor shower will peak on November 12th offering up to 10 meteors per hour. Best viewed just after midnight, this shower is known for its slow, bright fireballs lighting up the sky. On November 18, the Leonid meteor shower will grace the skies with up to 15 meteors per hour. On November 21st, Uranus will be at its closest approach to Earth, rising in the east at sunset. This is the best time to view the planet on November 27th, Saturn will resume its usual eastward motion through the constellations, marking the end of its retrograde phase. This change offers a new perspective on the planet's position in the night sky. On December 4th, gaze upon the year's final supermoon, known as the Cold Moon. The full moon will appear larger and brighter than usual. The Geminid meteor shower will peak on December 13, producing up to 150 meteors per hour. Known as the best meteor shower of the year, it's best viewed after midnight under dark skies away from city lights. On December 21st, the winter solstice marks the shortest day of the year in the Northern Hemisphere and the longest in the Southern Hemisphere. The sun shines directly over the Tropic of Capricorn marking the beginning of winter in the Northern Hemisphere and summer in the Southern Hemisphere. The Ursid meteor shower, the year's final meteor display, peaks on December 23rd, offering up to 10 meteors per hour visible just after midnight. It's a subtle yet magical farewell to the year's meteor showers. As the Earth completes another journey around the sun, we celebrate the end of 2025 and the beginning of a brand new year. Under the twinkling stars of the night sky, let's reflect on the wonders of the universe and look forward to even more cosmic adventures in 2026.
Happy New Year.